All right, everybody. So this is my new project. Uh, I've decided for now to keep the pickup truck. I've got a tent on the back of the pickup truck and I've got of a load of uh, equipment as well. Uh, camping equipment. So I'll just take you around now, show you what uh, the camping equipment I've got and, uh, and just show you the setup really. Right, so that's the tent set up on top of the uh, pickup. It's a proper pickup tent. Um, and and it's, it's quite good actually. I'll, I'll just take you around inside it now and just show you what's inside it. So this is what it's like. I've got a solar panel on that at the minute. So it's gonna be right sort of high tech this camping. So, right, so this is, let's un undo this. Just put that solar panel on the floor in a minute. Right, so this is inside the tent. Look, this have got plenty of vents and I've got a rechargeable fan up there, which is a three speed fan. Like I said, rechargeable. And it's also got a light on the top and it's uh, you can actually set it off and on remote con with the remote control so you've got plenty of vents windows here and I've got a blow up bed but I'm not going to be bothered about the blow up bed I'm going to use these actually because these are a lot more convenient these these like mattress things would be a lot more convenient and Christ I mean with that fan going in there I, I should be all right because it's not cold at night in Thailand is it at all so anyway so that's that's the tent. I'm just going to show you, I'll show you this solar panel in a bit, what the setup I've got with it. Right, so I'm going to, now I'm going to show you what sort of equipment I've got. Starting from this here, that side of the tyre, and I'm not going to put, I'm not going to put this up here, but what you do, you just sling it and it's a pop-up shower tent. And it, you just you just take it out of the bag, just throw it, uh, and it just pops up itself. So I've got that, that, and I've got all this camping equipment, and I've actually got four chairs, but um, I've only put two out here at the minute. So right, we'll we'll go we'll go from this side here. Right, yeah, I've got a, uh, an 80 amp 12 volt battery inside that and it turns this into a power station so it's linked to the lid on this and uh, you, you, you just turn it on and it shows you the, the voltage and everything if I turn it on here, there you go, 12.9 volts inside that battery so it's fully charged. Uh, here you've got USB connections here and you've got two cigarette lighter ports <coughs> and what it is at the back of that you can actually charge it through solar or just charge it to the vehicle battery if you want it to but I've connected a solar control box there and I've got it linked to this solar panel here which I, I just slip up so I've got my own power station that is getting charged all the time by the sun so that should keep that battery and if you look at the controller there it's charging at 13 volts you, send, you can see on the left hand side there it's showing you that the um, solar panels on it shows you the battery status and, it, and, and it's got two USB ports as well right so that's one thing I've got here the other thing I've got is this little box here which is 
a shower, a rechargeable shower. So this is quite good actually. Hey, I'll just show you this. So you just submerge this, you just submerge that into water. You connect the hose and then you've got a shower here. And you just dip it in into a bucket and you've got a lovely shower with three different settings on the shower on off switch on the shower itself on the shower head and it's brilliant it actually works fantastic as well because I've, I've already tried that out and it works brilliant so that's shower but actually i'm going to show you these type of things when i get out on field uh, i'm going to show you these things so there we go i've got an inverter there which I can plug in the cigarette lighter into that battery box there, plug it in, and I can use normal electrical appliances. Uh, this is that's got USB ports on the top, and it's got normal plugs in here as well. So the normal appliance, I've got, I've got a little electric hot pot there, which is a little camping one which is absolutely brilliant and uh, that works great on inverter as well I've tried that out but like I say when I get out when I get out in field I'm going to show you these things actually working and uh, it, it's I'm just showing you the, the actual equipment what I've got here now right so that there there's a fold-up toilet, which I can put in the shower tent as well. Uh, this here... Everything's rechargeable now, isn't it? Rechargeable blender. So that's a rechargeable blender. This here is a rechargeable fan a five speed fan as you can see and I can feel that as well and this is quite good also rechargeable and I say I can charge this off this battery and this battery will keep charged up by solar during the day so quids in right uh, so this is the other part of the camping equipment I've got I've got this here which is a it's virtually all me, me like my pans and everything like that all rolled into one which is uh, I don't know what these are like scoops or something but there you go that's that's the the pan set uh, just show you that that's the pan set with it within this you've got a little kettle of the pan and the little frying pan that's all within that and it all folds down nice and neat that then we've got um, a, a gas stove which is look how big that is it's minute isn't it but um, this is the gas stove so we take it out this little bag here and it all falls out so there we go and then you've got the legs underneath here so there you've got a nice little compact cooker so what you do you get your butane gas put your butane gas on here I'm, uh, I'm trying this out for the first time so I think that's it that's on so that's on and then you just uh, you just turn it on here and click it that's it 
Right, so that's the uh, that's the little cooking set. So like I say, you've got a pan there you can do some like stews in or whatever. Then you've got this little one here, which is a frying pan. And you've got a kettle. And it all folds down nice and neat. So I'll just show you again how it folds up. That goes in there. Kettle goes in there. Frying pan goes in there. It all folds up like that. I'll do it with two hands here. All folds up like that. That goes on there. And then you've got, uh, and then that goes in the, this little bag here. Without, without on top. All fits nice into that little bag. Now this is the cooker. All set up now. So all you do is you turn that on here. And click it. There you go. That's the cooker. All set up nicely. I think that will last for ages, that. To, but um, no, I think that's uh, that'll be set up nice. You've got a nice bit of heat in that, and the pans fit on there nicely. So I'll just turn that off, and that's the um, the cooking stuff. So I actually can't wait to get out onto the field and all that, and do a little, and just sit down, relax at Sinet River, do a. I don't know, do a bacon butty or some egg butty and some Just sit down and have a beer at Sidek River. Nice and relaxing. So the final items I've got is this. I've got here a, a little water container that'll carry enough water there to, to run my shower. I've got another water container here with a tap on that gives me fresh water. But I'll also be carrying fresh water in bottles in my uh, cooler box. So I've got a little cooler box here. That's a cooler box. Well, it's, it's a quite big one, actually. Uh, and that'll have all my me, me milk and uh, everything in it. And what, what I'm doing, it's not an electrical one. I was going to get an electrical one, but I decided against it because bags of ice are not all that dear. So I can get a couple of bags of ice, put ice in there, and actually it will keep it cooler than the electric fridges. So, um, and it's got a drain off point underneath this. So it, it's the, the excess water, but it, it lasts for uh, 15 hours. And, and also on that, you've got the, the, the little cup holders there yeah, with the drains off at the side as well so it's um, yeah I can't I can't wait to get this uh, this stuff organized so that's it um, all the camping equipment is all there now all I need to do is to buy a little bit of grub and get down there and uh, Yes, uh, I can't wait actually to get down there, do a little spot of camping down by the river. So uh, anyway, uh, this is only a little vlog showing you the camping equipment, what I've got. Um, I think uh, vlogs coming up with this, I'm going to take the tent down by the river and show you what it's like overnight camping down by the river. And then we're going to do vlogs further afield go further afield around thailand and uh, and uh, check it check it all out so anyway if you, if you like this please like share subscribe uh, to the channel and hit that notification bell for more little vlogs to come on this subject and also uh, generally living in thailand living in this village in thailand and it's uh, yeah, nice peaceful area this, lovely. It's uh, no hustle and bustle, not a lot of tourists or anything, and it's uh, all been in a, a nice Thai community.
lovely and peaceful. Anyway, thanks for watching. Catch you later.